Welcome back. Topping Sports, a former Olympian getting a special honor, and the recognition is coming from his very own community. Our Kimberly Mullings picks up the story. This has made a name for himself and the country as an Olympian back in the 70s, but says he's proud to know that he's recently been honored during the opening of the YMTA's community center in Hunters. Various sections of the park were unveiled, and the basketball court was named in honor of Fletcher Lewis Jr., a native of Hunters, who was able to advance to the finals in the men's long jump at the 1976 Olympics. He says most times, a man is never a hero in his hometown. I grew up in Hunters. I went to school in Hunters, except when I went to the Nassau or the St. Augustine's. And I played basketball a lot, even though a lot of people know me about for track and field. And for them to name a basketball court after me in my hometown, it's tremendous. He says from an early age, he recognized his talent. Okay, well, basketball, the first time I picked up a basketball was when I went to St. Augustine's in Nassau. And the next year I was on the school team. I play, went to, actually went to college to play basketball on a scholarship and I was a conference player of the year and uh, the MVP of my team so I could have gone to a number of schools to play basketball but I chose track and field because my goal was to go to the Olympics which I did and I became the first Bahamian to compete in the finals of a field event. Which year was that? 1976 in Montreal, Canada. Lewis is grateful that the country has given him his roses while he is still alive. Let me tell you something, I've been smelling roses now for the, I almost have a garden in my home. I've been smelling roses since November when I was elected into the Bahamas National Sports Hall of Fame. And then they had a track meet in my honor in February. And here we are again today, the crowning of achievement of all the things that has happened to me in my life, as far as my athletic endeavors are concerned. This is way up there above everything else because this is my hometown. Kimberly Mullings, Zednast Toll Sports. Thanks, Kim, and that's a look at your sports for this Friday.